story to tell. Pakistan's artillery will be supplemented with hundreds sub Chinese made 155mm SH 15 self propelled howitzers. That's what the website News Nation reported on December 24, 2019. Accordingly, 236 howitzers will be purchased by Islamabad under a contract with China's Marine Corps. According to some sources, the cost of each SH-15 is about $2.1 million. Currently, the main assets of Pakistani artillery force are US 155mm M109A5 check self propelled howitzers and Chinese 155mm SH-1 and 122mm SH-2 wheel self propelled howitzers. For years, Pakistan's armed forces have been in process to strengthen its artillery capability, especially with a new more mobile artillery solution. SH-15 self propelled howitzer was first introduced at the 1918 Zhuhai Air Show in Guangdong, China. This is a version developed from older SH-1 Designed with the main firepower is a 155mm L-52 howitzer mounted on the chassis of a 6x6 Shanxi truck. SH-15 was quickly put into service by a number of Chinese artillery units. This artillery system is also being supplied to export customers. Compared to SH-1 predecessor, SH-15 has several improvements. The better armor cabin accommodates a complete crew of four or five soldiers. The armor provides protection against small arms fire and artillery self sprinters for self-defense against infantry and aerial threats. A 12.7 mm heavy machine gun can be mounted on the roof. The self-propelled howitzer is said to fit a domestic Chinese diesel engine and weighs a maximum of 22 tons. It can reach a maximum speed of 90 km per hour on flat roads, operating drains up to 600 km. As mentioned above, the HS-15 retains the 150mm howitzer of the HS-1 and is provided with a semi-automatic loading system allows to increase the rate of fire twice as fast as the conventional way. The gun barrel is fitted with a double buffer muzzle brake. When moving, the ordnance is held in position by a clamp located to the immediate rear of the cup, which is operated by remote control. When the SH-15 is deployed in firing position, two large spades are lowered at the rear to provide a more stable firing platform, allowing it to maintain accuracy when firing at high speed. The vehicle is supported by ballistic computer system. Software programmed by Norin Core even allows the crew to control the howitzer remotely, ensuring safety in case of an enemy counterattack. The SH-15 has a maximum firing range of 20 km with standard ammunition and 53 km with a rocket-assisted projectile. The maximum rate of fire is 4 to 6 rounds per minute. It is compatible with all standard 155mm NATO ammunition as well as indigenous ammunition developed by Marine Corps. A special feature of this howitzer is that the chassis system is capable of raising or lowering depending on the terrain conditions and the payload. The built-in ammunition boxes are located on the each side of the vehicle quite clearly and are easily affected when the vehicle is moving on rough roads. A total of 48 rounds of ammunition reserve. Elevation and traverse is hydraulically operated
Overall, this self-propelled horizontal system is highly mobile and powerful. It can be deployed at long distances or can be transported by medium transport aircraft. It is light enough to be carried by Y9 or similar military transport aircraft. SH-15 will be the flexible choice for quick reaction units, enhanced combat power, survivability, automation, and digitization for artillery forces. My video of SH-15 self-propelled howitzer ends here. Thank you for watching. You find this video interesting? Please give me your thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to support the channel. Goodbye. See you again in the next videos.